Tyrannosaurus Flex Ezekiel James is going to be the opponent for Scotty Arrow. And he's a big guy too. Not as big as Brute, but no. he's got some size on Scotty. And he's got those muscles and he's going to look to use them to good effect against Scotty Arrow in this match. Scotty Arrow doesn't look any happier to be fighting Ezekiel James than he did to be fighting Brute fans like. So we'll see how things go here. For Scotty Arrow, liaison to the front office, Tino Caesar threatening to suspend Scotty Arrow without pay and death. I think it's just firing him at that point. It, that sounds that like is firing. effectively a firing. If he did not wrestle, and he is going to be taking on Tyrannosaurus Flex, Ezekiel James. And these two are having a little pose down in the center. It's Scotty Arrow looking to get out of here once more. Take two? No, he's going the other way this time. Maybe he's trying to just take off through the crowd. Exit is over that way. No. He is just uh, telling the fans that he has nothing to do with Ezekiel. He's chasing down Scotty Arrow. It's like that scene out of Jurassic Park. Tyrannosaurus Flex slamming Scotty Arrow head first into the apron of the ring. And then face first into the ring post. Scotty Arrow. Certainly not having the easy night that he thought he was going to have at intermission. Ezekiel James working Scotty Arrow over now at the 16 stone brew pub section. Working all four sides of this ring on the outside. Slamming Scotty face first into the ring apron once again. We're on to five for the count out here. James having some fun, but he needs to get Scotty Arrow back in the ring. Big shot by Ezekiel James. Referee Tim Vakula definitely letting this action go a little bit. Only on a count of six. Letting, maybe he's under orders from the front office to let this play out. Ezekiel James is having a good time on the outside, but the ref really should be getting these guys back. Scott the Arrow not having a good time on the outside. And they finally get things back in the ring. Scotty Arrow trying to get something in on Ezekiel James, but he hits with a big Manhattan drop and then a Polish hammer that flips Scotty Arrow end over end. And James very proud of himself at this point. He's got a body on him. He tore his ACL in 2016. He's made a miraculous recovery. Absolutely. Looks in better shape than ever. And well, now Scotty Arrow going to that knee. 
Got to hear off the ropes. He just get to the side. Pop up. European uppercut by Ezekiel James. Looks like he might have just grazed Scotty Arrow there, but still enough to rock Scotty Arrow badly. Ezekiel James firing up the crowd here. He's stalking him. No, air, no arrow offense yet, this man. And he's got him up to fireman's carry. Powers it back up. Oh, big time. Sit out. Michinoku driver, landslide, that's it. That's the dino drop, and there was no escape from Scotty Arrow this time. Ezekiel James with a definitive victory over Scotty Arrow. Scotty Arrow not, uh, not having the best evening here. I, I guess maybe that was marginally. Would you rather be in a triple threat with Dante Dio and Brute Vance like or have to have taken on Ezekiel James in a singles match? That's a tough one. What is what is the correct choice in that? Sophie's choice, I, if you I will. I still think running away from Brute is the right choice. <laughs> yeah, I mean, honestly. You may be right, but Scotty Arrow not coming out of day one unscathed. And Ezekiel James gets the victory here. Got to expect big things on the rise from Tyrannosaurus Black. He looked fantastic. T Flex, congratulations on your win. Thank you. What is in store for you in NYCW? Well, I don't know if the NYCW crowd knows the Tyrannosaurus Flex, but you might now. And I'm ready to flex on the entire roster back there. And I'm ready for the future. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Towards flex, and I don't think we've seen the last of Scotty Arrow. Certainly not, as he did to manage.